This is Dr. Kelly Cahill's wake-up call six days a week at 5 a.m. Eight years ago, we started lifting weights to stay in shape, but at 43, he's already carried enough. As a sophomore in high school, I was diagnosed with uh, bone cancer in my leg. After a year of chemotherapy, Kelly thought it was all over, but the cancer wasn't gone, so he decided to have his left leg amputated in his senior year at STM. Yeah, you go from an invincible 16-year-old uh, to, um, you know, not <laughs> overnight. His goal was to walk at his graduation, and three months later, he pulled it off. Went through a you know brief period of, of depression. It was very similar to going through chemo. You really just have to take one day at a time, one step at a time, one foot in front of the other, literally. Whether it's here at the gym or out at the beach, Kelly has an adventure telling people random stories about how he lost his left leg. One little boy asked me if it was going to be if it, my leg was going to grow back, so I thought that was kind of funny. You know, my my pat answer at the beach is that a shark bit it off. Kelly has three kids. One once took him to show and tell. He has one message to tell everyone facing adversity. Everyone really has their, their cross to bear. I think mine is a little more externally visible, but um, I think you just can only take one, one day at a time. Ron Snyder, News 15.